Hello and welcome to this short training video on QuizCon Forms. In this video, we will learn how to configure a field default values based on another field's default value. An advantage of QuizCon Forms over out of the box SharePoint is the ability to dynamically set a field's default value based on the value of another field. One example, and what we will do in this video, is whenever a user uploads a document, make sure that the default value of the document title field is the same as the document name in order to improve search results. We're in the documents document library and let's go to the dynamic default values setting page. Like I said before, our goal for this video is to set a title field default value to always be the name field in this document library when somebody uploads a document. So in the field section, I will select the title field. Since this rule applies to everyone, I will not enter anything in the users and group section. In the default value section, whenever we refer to another column, we need to enter the name of that column between square brackets. The name, if we look in the fields, the name of the document name field is name. So if I want to refer to it, I have to enter name between square brackets. That way, the title field will be equal to the name field. Let's click on Add Default Value Rule, click on OK, and go to the document library and see what happens. I will upload a document that I have here, Test Document. Wait for it to upload, it shouldn't take long. When I go to see the document's properties, you'll see that the name field equals the title field because of the rule that we created in QuizCom Forms. Thank you for watching this video on how to configure a field's default value based on another field's default value on QuizCom Forms.